What's up, guys? Uh, Monday here. Hope everybody had a good weekend. Um, sorry for no face cam. My recording settings are being weird. I kind of look gross right now anyways, too, so you're not missing much. Um, but anyways, what we were talking about in, like, the intermission, uh, about how, like, don't you think it's weird that people think it's sad that you just sit at home and play video games alone, quote-unquote, all day, when, yeah. like... You're not doing it alone. <laughs> like, you do it with other yes, people, like, way. almost 100% of the time. It's actually, like, yeah. basically constantly being connected to at least somebody that you consider your friend. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, but. Like, oh, when, uh, so when people are like, when, when will you stop playing those video games? And why won't you just go and be social? Yeah. Why won't you have a. Friends in your life? Yeah. <laughs> I am making friends. And I am currently talking to said friends. Yeah, it's like, you I need a hobby. Like this is my hobby. My <laughs> yeah, hobby. yeah. And it's unlike like, woodworking, I, I can do it with other people. <laughs> like, or yeah. art, or... It's not, yeah. Whenever I want, pretty much free. Like, I know, like, game on free. But when you have the game, yeah. <laughs> All you need is your console or whatever, and you just... You go whatever you want. It's so easy. Right. It's actually one of like the cheapest. It's weird for what it actually offers you. It's like one of the cheapest addictions. I mean, like if you're really, really into it, it's not cheap at all. But like, but yeah. But like, yeah. if you can afford like three hundred dollars every couple years to get the the newest system like a year too late and you can spend sixty dollars to play a video game for like a hundred hours on it like skyrim or something like that like it's so like the dollar per hour of entertainment yeah the the, the dollar per hour of entertainment amount is ridiculous yeah especially like rocket league granted once again like i said it gets up like up there if you become like really into the hobby but um for me like i got this during my three months so it is literally right I yeah every single second from it like i have literally not lost yeah you never pay well apart from time apart from time but then again i want to time playing this game right I'm yeah i'm enjoying myself like li it, there's literally no downfall in downloading this game for free especially after i played it like how would the next thing right that's a purely game yeah, and the crazy thing is you still probably did end up spending- Wait, actually, you probably haven't spent much of this at all. You, do you ever actually buy keys? Uh, I've only ever bought, like, keys when, uh, like... Oh, I used to buy, like, I bought, like, a batch of, like, five before when it was a new crate that I really want, like, twice or three times. Yeah, that and makes then, sense. other than that, I like, bought 10 keys when the first Ooh. rocket pass came out. Uh, I brought 10 keys when the first rocket pass came out, but then I didn't have to buy it again because I just used the 10 keys that you get from the rocket pass to then get the next one. Yeah. And obviously, like I said, I've got like these knives anyway, so I've always like had all other keys for my like, trading stuff. Right. Well, that guy almost bumped me after he flicked into that. Yeah, that makes sense. I feel like this would be a game where you could have a pretty decent inventory while being free to play. I mean, you got to get lucky too, but I know I got like a black market from a golden egg on my other account. I got that chameleon. I think I talked about that earlier in the series at one point, but like that was pretty cool because I was like, damn, like, like if I was actually free to play, yeah, if, if I was actually free to play, I would, <laughs> I would be so happy about this. I've actually, I got a black market from a decryptor once too. I think I got yeah, slipstream from a golden egg before too. I think that's my uh, most viewed video on YouTube actually. Just kidding. Wait, no, it's not. That was the next episode after, and it got no views at all. I remember I tried to click bait two twice in a row. So, the first one it was a golden egg opening, and then it was also oh wow, thank God that didn't go in. I know. <laughs> yeah, okay, so in a two day period, you remember that like golden egg video I clickbaited and got yeah, a bunch of videos? Well, it was, it was search engine optimization more than clickbait, because, anyways, 
it, I wasn't lying, but it, it was like golden egg opening and opening the rarest black market or something like that. Um, or wait, no, it was opening a black market. You know what? I think opening a black market from a crate was, uh, for, from a golden egg was the one that popped off. And then the next day I tried to do like opening golden eggs, right? Which was just like the last one I had left, I think. <laughs> and then, um, the other thing was, uh, was, and getting like the rarest black market from a decryptor, which at the time I got dissolver from a decryptor. And I thought that that would go just as viral because it was kind of the same thing, you know, opening golden eggs and getting whatever from a decryptor, even though like decryptor was added on to the end. So it wasn't as powerful, but like people wouldn't notice it is what I thought. Uh, <laughs> um, but that one got like no views at all. <laughs> is that weird? Yeah, that's the same with me. Like I have like, sort of a friend. He's not like... Thanks. Um, but I... Well, I sort of know this guy called like Jorgen. He's a bit of a. He, he, he's a YouTuber. Uh, is, he, is he PewDiePie's horse? And I've known him like about longer than you would say. Yeah, yeah. I've been about around like. Twenty years. I should have stayed, I guess. I've never like. Dead close to him, but he's always in parties. Like, I can play Rocket League with him. He brought him into our friend group a little bit, but he was friends with me once again with another person called Ryan, not my name Ryan, but another person. So if you know yeah. Oliver, yeah, I'm that's right. It's one of the Oliver Mori friends called Ryan. Okay. Well, Ryan has been found with someone that he met with and he started coming into more our group than he and just the bar. Yeah. And, uh, Yes. Right. <laughs> and, and essentially, it was um, we brought him in, and then he's been doing YouTube now, and he's got like 360, 270 subs, so fair play. But and then I've been like doing it as well. It was only since he popped up, it sort of almost inspired me to like try doing it because we did the same sort of like game stuff. But I thought I'd be you know, like I'll try doing it. Right. Um, and then he meant to give this video doing like an old opening goal in X and he got like a thousand views or something like that. Uh -huh. And I was like, he just kept explaining to him for like, I don't even think he's, uh, I don't know, I don't even think he's done now that special. Uh, and he got like a thousand views. I always did it as part of like a Christmas special, like, oh, sorry, and then asterisks, new, those asterisks, golden eggs, like on Christmas, and all those, like, oh, no, like Whatever it was called that was anyway, golden presents, like that, like, golden gifts. Like, yeah, yeah, gifts. Yeah. Golden gifts. And um, it got like four or five views. I was like, what? <laughs> what <the hell?" laughs> yeah, I totally understand that it gets annoying when you're like, it's the same thing. It's funny, but it's kind of like you copied somebody homework and you, somebody's homework and you got a worse grade. And you're like, what? How? It's it. I literally said the same thing he said. <laughs> Although I never really did that. I would be generous to him. Like, what the hell? Weird question. Did you let people copy off you? And or copy people? Uh, no, I didn't have enough, I didn't have enough friends. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's weird. I mean, I had people that, like, weren't my friends. I mean, like, I didn't hate them either. They're, like, and it's a small school. So everybody's kind of your friends. But, like, uh, I had people that would just be like, yo. Like, <laughs> I would just be like, Dude, come on! But then I was just like, at the same time, I was like, it's really not a big deal. Like, <laughs> like I, did have, I, I occasionally had people say like, "Oh, did you do the homework?" And I'd be like, "Yeah." They'd be like, "What did you do for that?" And then I'd tell them, and then like, they don't even think copy it. Like, they'd already done it, and they like wanted to know. Yeah. And then I never, I never copied when I did the Actually, I copied it once, but it was ages ago. It was in, it was in my primary school. In like year three or four. So okay. Like, so like grade four or five school, I think. Um, and um, I remember we were doing, we used to do like a times table thing. Like we have to do like a times table test, you know, like your three times table, four times table, and stuff like that. Yeah. Like your maths. Yeah. And um, if you complete, your, for example, you all started off doing the two times table. In your five time tables. If you pass that week, next week you did your threes and your fours. 
week after that, if you passed, you did your six. If you passed that, you did your seven. If you passed that, you did your eight. If you passed that, you did your nine. Um, yeah. And that's like basically what you do for a year. And obviously, like I said, we're all really young, so like, it's very easy now. But like that, it's a lot harder. And I remember I got me and this girl called, like, me, well, there was a few other people, but I passed at every single um, one first time. Got to the seven times table and I failed the first time. Like, I, I got one thing wrong. And then I felt so annoyed, so good. The next week, uh, there was a person I was doing it, like, sort of, like, over the table. And it looked for, like, one or two of, like, the, the uh, like, one of the answers. I like, for, like, six times seven or something like that. No, no, no. It would have been, like, eight times seven or something like that. And I four times seven. I wasn't like, so sure on Okay. No, no, it's eight times seven and nine times seven. I wasn't sure. I, was I get that. Seven is a weird two, one, man. Just for those two, I was like, eight times seven times nine. I was like, what's that? She looked over here and I was like, I bet, she, I hope she's done right. And she did, and it came back in the past. I was like, yes. I was like, shit. That's the only time I've ever done like that. Yeah. I'd have to like look for it before, and like, it's not possible to just like ask. Yeah. Yeah, I definitely remember. Yeah, so that, that happened a lot for homework. That's the only time where I like that she is a like look to my one without that conviction. Yeah, I that I did that one time in my whole life, and I thought I would never do it until I just like. A, it was it's tough to explain it was in college and it was like a r just ridiculously hard science class that i wasn't even in the science that i was super into and I, that semester i realized that i didn't even want to major in the science that i was into anymore so i was like super depressed and taking like these really really hard classes and even then i was fine in all the other ones but in organic chemistry too which is supposed to be like the, one of the hardest classes in the whole chemistry major and i wasn't even taking chemistry i uh i like cheated on the person in front of me just to like make sure i got a decent enough grade and on the final to to uh to like pass because i just i wasn't gonna take it again that's for sure and then if i wasn't gonna take it again it was gonna sit on my gpa which sucks because if you take it again you do better it replaces the old one but if you just don't take it again it doesn't get you know referred or something it doesn't just become non-existent like you still had got a bad grade like in a class and failed it or whatever it didn't get your credits so i was like i gotta get my credits like i spent i literally spent money on this <laughs> Yeah. yeah so at the time i felt horrible but looking back at it there's a part of me that's like i helped so many people through high school like so many people <laughs> like like i i was pretty smart and i did not give a fuck about like you copying off me or cheating off me or whatever like maybe like a little bit at times maybe certain people that i actually didn't really like but 90 percent of the time i just let people do stuff yeah, if anyone would have said it to me, like, I was like, I'm really excited to know that, because I didn't know, like, how much it, like, would have been, like, me. I would have been like, yeah, literally just write it. Like, sometimes people are struggling there, like, literally just tell them what to write. Like, not necessarily in lesson or in an exam. Yeah. But, like, it's homework or it's, like, Yeah, normally for homework, people. I wouldn't let people straight copy me. I would, like... Well, if it was English and stuff, I would let them, like, at least read what I read and write something kind of similar. But if it was, um... I guess if it was math, I'd let them just copy me because that's the only way it was right. <laughs> um... I'm trying to fucking think what, what my point was. I'm so focused on the game. I feel bad. <coughs> oh, yeah. So, oh, wait. If it was math, I wouldn't let them copy me. I would talk them through it. That's what I should say. I would talk them through it and, like, give them the right answer. Like, get them to the right answer. Like, I was, like, a teacher or, like, a... And same thing with science. Oh, that's that's why. That's why. But he's going to try to read this. It's, it's super close to the wall. No way. just like verbally vomited for 10 seconds I'm across Ooh, one more nope you can control oh, I'll be
I got it. I need boost. I don't know why I went up for that. I thought it was going to hit the ceiling, but... I'm up. Oh, I shouldn't have spent all of it. Our teammates in a bad spot too. You got the mid sweet. Ooh. Uh nice try. I kind of need boost, but I didn't want to give up defensive positioning on the, uh... Oh. They're all clumped up to the right side, or their left side. Our right side. It's crazy. Literally nobody's on the opposite side of the field in like multiple seconds. And now they all move to the other side of the field. Oh, it's so bad. I don't get it. Okay, one guy's in the middle of the field finally. It, everyone does that though. Like even like all the way up that happens so much. Where like the whole team is on the like. Yeah. They're just at different levels of like length of the field. But their width is like so uniform it's so gross nice yeah they were literally all in a line like on the wall <laughs> as when i started talking about that all right i'm gonna end there i uh, hope everybody has a good day peace